Hey guys. Um, today I got another video. Well, this is gonna be a gas mask video of my gas mask. Um, yeah. You might have seen it before in a different video, but uh, that didn't have no sound unfortunately. So I'm gonna redo it. Um, I have ordered another one. So yeah, I will do also a review on that one too. So let's go to it. So yep, this is a World War II um, military gas mask uh, used by the British um, military. So yep, this is the case. Right now, as you can see, it has a simple pull it up, but then once that comes up, then that there you gotta put into there and then click that down there so yeah that's how you lock it this is a basic um just strap that you see all the time um it does have a pocket on the side or something and um and a pocket on the other side So yeah, the other pockets. Just get that one closed. Um. There we go. Right. Okay. So yeah, let's uh get it open, shall we? Okay. So. Is, uh, okay. Okay. So um, yep. Let's just put this to one side a sec. Okay. So yep. This is uh the gas mask. Currently without the filter on it. Yep. And then. That stays it, and then that's the filter then next to it there. Just move those up. Right, okay. So yeah guys, um this case is from you know, guys we will see more of these in a sec. Okay. Alright, so this case actually dates back to um uh, 1945. Uh, I don't think the camera can see that, but uh, just um, there. Just right there. 1940. 1943, actually, sorry. So, yeah, it's just. Yeah, the camera should be able to see that. So yeah, this case uh, dates back to then. Um, uh, there's nothing much to say about it, but it was made by W and G in 1943. So yeah, that's uh, the case date. Okay, now we're gonna have a look at the date of the mask itself. Right. Okay. So. Um, it says on the side of the mask that um, it has a date on the side of the mask, 23rd of the 10th, 44, which is obviously 23rd of the 10th, 1944. Uh, see that date there? Right, okay, so yep. Yeah. This dates back to 1944, this gas mask. So, yep. Yeah. Um, Royal Post, that's what it says. Got a stamp on there for that. Um, then we got the um, the filter, and um, this is the filter itself. Um, 
this dates to 1992 because this is a, um, a uh, I don't know what, what could you call it, um, a replace filter then. Okay, and then this thing that's on the filter. Okay, so this guys is um, the uh, dust cap for the filter, so it stops any dust getting inside the filter itself. Um, this is the filter. It um, dates back to 1982, like I just said. I'm not sure if the camera can see that at all. Hmm. It says it right there. No, it doesn't come uh, add that, but um, anyway, let's put the um, it on the mask. That was safe. Alright, that's what it looks like with it on. Um, yep, so people would wear it like that. With that on the side. Um, probably with a uh, bag on the um, shoulder, maybe. And they probably wouldn't have had this dust cap, but um, it's a good, uh, it's a good uh, add-on to have with the mask anyway. So uh, I think that's uh, wrapped up for my video this evening, guys. Um. Be sure to uh, comment, like, and subscribe. Um, uh, yeah, well, I'm sorry I couldn't really tell the the, um, the make of this gas mask or what it actually is, but I know it's um, it's a World War Two military gas mask, so that's pretty much all I know. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and see you in the next video when I get a new, my new gas mask. Bye.